Welcome back guys, this is series of tutorial on how to send an email with attachment using PHP. Please check the video description for the download and demo link. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to submit a form uh, via Ajax using jQuery form plugin. We need a jQuery form plugin. So I just downloaded and added to the uh, project JS folder. So also I included in the index.html now i'm going to uh, um, app.js and select the form contact form and add the ajax form functionality ajax form so what i will do i will create a form um, variable okay instead of selecting form uh, two times i will select one times i will save it in the form variable this improves the performance so it's a bad practice to select the same element multiple times so I selected, selected the form one time and save it in the variable I use the variable uh, wherever I want so in the Ajax form I will you know pause the options uh, data type JSON I am expecting JSON response also i will before submit uh, it's a call up function in the before submit i i check whether the form is valid or not so form dot valid returns whether the form is valid or not so if it is not valid I return false I will not allow form to submit okay um, next I have two more callback functions so just reload the form okay we'll clear dropped up so i mean because we added the validation we will not submit the form until you you clear the all the errors just clicking on submit yeah without reloading the page the form gets posted via ajax next we will have the loader uh, when you click on submit we will show the loader uh, when successfully sent a mail we will I the load we will show success or failure based on um, the response okay we will show the model pop-up next now we will add the loader uh, to the our um, contact form so add this system so I will add the CSS style in the style of CSS so now reload so the loader is working so now i will select this loader in jQuery. so what i will do uh, i will create the variable called loader and in the loader i will select this uh, loader div and save it okay so in the document dot ready so when the document is ready i am adding this loader okay now reload once the document is ready, the loader will will add automatically. So also when I, uh, so the load I need to show the loader when you submit the form. Okay, in the before submit, when the form is valid, I will show the loader. I need to add the loader when we get the response from either success or failure. Uh, we need to add the uh, loader and show the response to the users okay now reload the page and submit yeah once the response got from the server yeah, add it okay uh, next we will add the model pop-up to show uh, the success and failure status to the user 
Finally, we are adding Bootstrap model uh, to the contact form to show success and failure status to the users. So I'm just adding Bootstrap uh, model HTML to this next uh, HTML. Okay. Next, I will create um, two variable lab batches. So each will contain one SQL will contain um, with reference to the model and another is will contain reference to the model content model and model content okay so next um, so we will show the model uh, in success callback or failure callback okay we need to show so when it is success we need to show the response in green color when it is in failure we need to show the success in red color okay so also um, we will show the message when it is success we will say the message is mail sent us successfully when it is failure um, we will show the message is made a send failed so try again okay so in ajax uh, ajax form a uh, data type is we are given as json so it expects json response so we need to do some changes in mail.php so we will delete this so uh, now as of now we will sh echo uh, the success and failure messages if you do this the uh, the response will be sent back to the front end will be in text format so but it expects the json format so so we need to send the json format response from the back end to the front end so what i do i create a response on layer function okay so when it is success i will send the so i will call the response handler and pause the true and send the message when it is failure i will send the I will call the response handler. I will pause false and messages to this one. In response handler, when it is true, I send this response status code as a 200 and the message. When it is false, I will send the response code as a 500 and send the message. So I will, you know, decode this array and send the JSON as a response to the front end. Okay. Now. If it is success, the success callback will be executed. If it is failure, the error callback will be executed. Okay, now go and reload the page. Submit. Uh, in order to boost up model needs to work, we need to add uh, add. Bootstrap uh, JS. Now I included the reference reference to Bootstrap Mind.js. So now if I reload. Yeah, we get the successfully response. We are showing the response to the user because so also we, if you see, the mail has successfully received. See. Thanks for watching and please subscribe and press the bell icon to get the updates immediately.